Hi, Dyslexic Genius here, Brad Hurt. My phone number is 864-236-1680, or you can email me at dyslexicgeniushurt at gmail.com. I'm going to talk about, I'm back on this exhibition, but I want to show you some upgrades. When you're cutting the white gasket material here, this stuff, you want to cut it so it's squared off here. Perpendicular. Perpendicular to it. And when you cut them, you want to make sure that it's a little bit longer. You want to have to kind of push it in. Because when you do it right, you barely see the line. And this holds it in place. You want it expanding back. When you do them badly, like this one was sent to me, this is what happens when you don't know how to put the gasket material in. And this helps hold it in place. Originally, the, the rubber they stuck in there was one white O-ring, and it just popped in. But nowadays, you know, we don't have those. We have this white rubber. The other thing I did is I polished out the exhibition on the back of it so you can see it through the mica. Like that, it's gonna look nice. And now, how do I put these springs in on an exhibition? I hold mine in place with a set of Kellys. Those were mine. Those were my sweet angels, Kellys, because she was an RN, and she's like really smart. <laughs> and when you put them in, the springs have a little bump to the top where the, the screw comes through, and those face up toward the needle bar here where the, the needle goes in. So when you're putting them in, you have to think, okay, this is in reverse, so I have the little bump here facing down because the screw is going to come in this way. I haven't tightened that up yet. And this is a much easier way of holding them and then putting the screws in. Because you, we got a little bitty screw, we got this thing, it's wiggling all over the place. Or you can put it in a vise, you know, the exhibitions, the number twos like this, their spring is kind of like a C curve, and they're really tough sometimes to get put in. And I mount, I mount these in a little jeweler's vise I have, but the Kellys work well. You know, this is a lot of fun. I'm just trying to sh point out some really cool tips on rebuilding reproducers or like the exhibition and the number two. And that's my tip for the day.